everyone so i just quickly wanted to pop in here because throughout this video you're going to hear me talking about how i'm feeling a lot of the time and what i'm struggling with and mentally physically it's in my head and like inner struggles and things i'm going through throughout the vlog and I just wanted to take this moment to thank BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video because if there's anything I've learned from the past year is that it's very important to become more comfortable speaking about what you're going through in your head, um, in your body, what you're feeling and talk about it and I think BetterHelp is a great outlet to use if you don't have people who you feel comfortable talking to about your mental health issues or things you're concerned about within your own head. For me personally, for me personally, I've had a lot of walls and issues within myself that have stopped me from achieving my goals and made me scared to be happy and things like that. And now I'm at a place where I'm able to talk about my problems and I share them with you guys and how I feel. And it's a great outlet for me in regards to getting feedback from you guys and advice and things like that. But overall, I've learned that you need to put your mental health first. BetterHelp will assess your needs and match you with, with your own licensed professional therapist who you will be in communication with within 48 hours. BetterHelp is not a crisis line. It's not self-help. It's licensed counseling done online. What's nice about BetterHelp is obviously during a time like this, even though things are opening up, it's still nice to do things virtually. There's a broad range of expertise within BetterHelp's network of counselors with over 15,000 counselors within their community, which may be a lot more than you have in your area right now. The service is also available for clients worldwide. What's nice about doing it online is you don't have to wait in an uncomfortable waiting room. Um, it can be on your schedule through video, photo. You can also log in at any time and message your counselor with whatever issue or problem you're having. BetterHelp also is very open to the change of counselor. They want you to be comfortable and happy with your counselor. So if it's not a good fit, you can easily change. One of the best parts is that it is more affordable than traditional in-person counseling and there is financial aid available for those in need. BetterHelp wants you to start being happier today. So if you guys are interested and want to learn more, you can visit betterhelp.com. So that's better H-E-L-P. And join over 1 million people taking charge of their mental health today. And for all of you guys, um, I have a special discount code that'll give you 10% off your first your first month at BetterHelp. I'll put it here as well as in the description box. So I urge you guys to check it out if it's something that would apply to you and you could see the benefits in your life. I think everybody should give it a shot and if you're not talking to somebody, this is a great option. Thank you so much BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. And yeah, I just want to keep that in mind throughout the whole video. We're all going through stuff. Life is tough. I'm here for you. BetterHelp is here for you. I love you. Enjoy the video. Hello, everybody. I don't know if this is a new vlog or not. I think it will be. I just moved into Lucy's for a month. So for Lucy and Ava aren't here. It's just me. Yeah, it's really humid today. It's disgusting. I haven't eaten anything. I'm starving. I'm really tired, but I can't. I don't know what's going on. I don't think the Wi-Fi is working or like they don't have Wi-Fi anymore, but my data barely works for some reason. Um, so I'm just like really struggling out here. I came here because I wanted to work all day, but now I have no Wi-Fi. So I think I'm going to be filming all day. I'm delusional because I'm so hungry and I wanted to just order food because I can't even think of where to go and get food even though I totally could if I wanted to. <laughs> I could think of somewhere to go get food in the area. Anyway, I'm gonna unpack my stuff. I've had some movers come, drop off a mattress um, and a bunch of other stuff, but I'm really tired. So I'm gonna have to try and figure this out. I just sweep the floor. Anyway, I look disgusting. This is really gross. I'm just like, should I just go walk to Sweet Green? I feel like Sweet Green's doing this thing where it's like only, like you have to order through the app or some shit. And it's like, I just don't have Wi-Fi though. I don't have the app. 
Anyway, this is my struggle right now. Sorry, I'm a little, I'm gonna be annoying right now. I feel like I'm being annoying. It's just like, I really don't feel great, so. I'm gonna figure some stuff out, keep you guys updated, but. Hi. So this is the huge ass mattress from Awara, Awara. Thank you so much for sending it to me, but it's so heavy. So keep that in mind if you're getting this mattress. Um, I'm literally just pushing it with my knees because it's so heavy. Okay, so I got the mattress out. Um, I'm just gonna be sleeping on a mattress. I didn't get a bed frame because I'm only here for a month. Um, yeah, I'm out of breath. Hello, everybody. I don't know if this is a new vlog or not. I think it will be. But I just, I just moved into Lucy's for a month. Except for Lucy and Ava aren't here. It's just me. Yeah, it's really humid today. It's disgusting. I haven't eaten anything. I'm starving. I'm really tired, but I can't, I don't know what's going on. I don't think the Wi-Fi is working or like they don't have Wi-Fi anymore, but my data barely works for some reason. Um, so I'm just like really struggling out here. I came here because I wanted to work all day, but now I have no Wi-Fi. So I think I'm gonna be filming all day. I'm delusional because I'm so hungry and I wanted to just order food because can't even think of where to go and get food, even though I totally could if I wanted to. <laughs> I could think of somewhere to go get food in the area. Anyway, I'm gonna unpack my stuff. I've had some movers come, drop off a mattress, um, and a bunch of other stuff, but I'm really tired. So, I'm gonna have to try and figure this out. I just sweep the floor. Anyway, I look disgusting. This is really gross. I'm just like, should I just go walk to Sweet Green? I feel like Sweet Green's doing this thing where it's like only, like, you have to order through the app or some shit. And it's like, I just don't have Wi Fi though. I don't have the app. Anyway, this is my struggle right now. Sorry, I'm a little, I'm gonna be annoying right now. I feel like I'm being annoying. It's just like, I really don't feel great. So. I'm gonna figure some stuff out, keep you guys updated, but. Hi. So this is the huge ass mattress from Awara, Awara. Thank you so much for sending it to me, but it's so heavy. So keep that in mind if you're getting this mattress. Um, I'm literally just pushing it with my knees cause it's so heavy. Okay, so I got the mattress out. Um, I'm just gonna be sleeping on a mattress. I didn't get a bed frame because I'm only here for a month. Um, yeah, I'm out of breath. <laughs> All right, so here's the mattress. Here are some scissors I found, Lucy. I'm using your scissors. I don't really know how to cut a mattress, to be honest. I'm just gonna cut all this plastic off and hope for the best. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Guys. It's just blowing up. Okay, so this is my first brand new mattress I've ever had. My first new mattress experience, so that was pretty cool for me. I'm literally sweating. I look so horrible. I have no makeup on. I'm just gross. But yeah, new mattress check. I don't have a sheet though. I should probably get one. I don't know if there's like a top or a bottom to this. Oh yeah, this is definitely the bottom. Ugh. Okay, so um, I'm gonna go walk.
walk around and get something to eat or go to Dwayne Reed or something and just get some stuff because I haven't even had coffee today. I don't know. Maybe that's why, but I have a bunch of packages, mostly from Amazon, that I wanted to unbox with you guys. Let's see what we got. Oh, I actually don't think this one's from Amazon. This one's from Taurus. I don't know who this is from. This is Coolify. What is this? Oh, I think this is like a portable air conditioner. Wait, it's actually crazy because I was just literally just complaining about how sweaty I was. So wait, this could be really good. It's just so humid today in New York. It's like disgusting. Oh my God, what is this? It's a wearable air conditioner. How do you wear this? I think it's like headsets. I don't know, I'll try it out later. But that's super cool. Super cool. This one is from Amazon. This is, oh, I'm gonna do like a TikTok showing everything I got from Amazon. Cause I kind of went on a little Amazon spree. I know buying from Amazon isn't the best, but convenience. I got this huge, I love New York, extra large t-shirt to wear as like a sleep shirt. It's Cause I don't have a lot of sleep shirts. So I got this on Amazon. You can also get them in like every size pretty much. Um, if you want like a baby tea version or whatever, I just already have one. So yeah, I got that. I'll link all the Amazon items below. I'll try and link the Coolify too if I can find it if you're interested. I think there's a bunch of things in here. I feel like I need to sit up more. I feel like you guys are gonna see my mood completely like flip once I have like some energy in me because I'm super dead right now and I feel like it's super obvious. So I got some hair clips. I'll go more into depth with all this stuff later. I just like really want to open this stuff. And um I got more hair clips and get food. I got a little cosmetic cute mirror. I got two pairs of jeans to try, which I'm very excited for. I got two skirts, I believe. Yeah, I got a lot in that box. Okay, I think I can't do this. I think I literally am going to die if I don't eat right now. <laughs> so I'm drinking Lucy's bong water. I don't know, I need like Wi-Fi and the Wi-Fi is not really working for me and I have to do something with Wi-Fi at 5 p.m. So, okay, so I just found out she doesn't have Wi-Fi anymore, which is a problem because my data doesn't really work. Okay, I'm gonna run out and just get some like coffee thing. So I'm re-energized for a bit and then probably go home at like 4 30. okay guys i just got back and i can't even explain to you guys how i feel right now it's just horrible it's disgusting outside like i'm sweating everywhere it's so hot and like sticky out there i got a coffee i went to join reed and i literally went in there i was like my head is like pounding i was like i don't want anything like why am i here I don't know, I just didn't really know what I was doing. I just kept being like, what the hell am I doing? I'm apologizing so much for my appearance right now. It's rather dreadful. Um, and then I also went to Sweet Green, because thank God they weren't doing their app thing. And I got a spin drift for after I drink my coffee. I love spin drift. And then I got a kale Caesar salad. I'm literally so weak right now, it's crazy. But, yeah. Yummy, let's eat. Looks like they don't really put as much ingredients as they normally do, but I don't really care. I'm gonna devour this. And then tonight, me and Luca are going to dinner at Planta, which I'm super excited for because if you guys are an OG from Toronto, you know Planta is, a Toronto restaurant, uh, vegan, plant-based, or I don't know, it's vegan, I know it's plant-based, um, restaurant, and it's so good, 
and they opened one in New York literally last week and they invited me and Luca in for dinner and I'm so excited because it's such a good store and I'm so, I mean restaurant I'm so glad they're in New York next restaurant that needs to come to New York is Sugo I miss Sugo so much I think it would do so well too Okay, I'm gonna eat. Sometimes I think I'm superwoman and I think I can do everything on like no energy or like when I'm recovering and like sick and shit like that. I still think I can function normally and do a million things, but I can't. <laughs> and I'm realizing that today. I was like, I'm gonna get to Lucy's. I'm gonna film this video, this video. Things are going wrong. I feel like shit, it's just not happening. So, you know, it's okay. salad so drinking my coffee feeling a little bit better let's move over there and keep opening some packages because that always puts me in a good mood and i got some fun ones ah this is really heavy this is another one from amazon not sure what it is oh this is a really cute skirt Super cute, little low-waisted skirt. Love. Like little bathing suit cover-up type vibe. It's like orange, it looks pretty yellow though. Oh, I also bought this crochet little dress cover-up. I just thought this could be a beach moment. Um, it's like strapless, it goes like that, and then I'll like show it, show it on, but it like drapes open, it slits in the middle. I just think it's giving beach vibes and I'm manifesting a beach vacation. So that was that purchase. And then this company called Jam, um, they make their own candles. I actually ran into the guy as I was walking back into the apartment. And he had just dropped off these candles for me, and he was so sweet. He said him and his brother make them. That he His brother's actually, like, an architect and has, like, an architect software or whatever where he designs things on, and then from there they, like, create candles. I don't know how they, like, transfer the design to the candle, but basically that's how they do it. But I'm really excited to share with you guys because their candles are stunning. Stunning what it looks like it's wrapped very carefully so okay this is the first one so gorgeous like this is a piece of art i will make sure to link their instagram below it's just so stunning i'm obsessed with it i can't believe they gave those to me they're so beautiful and then the color too this one looks like a little cupcake love it so beautiful and then I think there's one more in here. Oh, there's a big guy in here. Oh, so gorgeous. Like what? These are like my favorite candles I've ever received ever. Like it's, I don't know if you can see the detail, but there's so much detail and like fine lines to these candles. I just think it's so beautiful and I really like praise amend i don't know give credit to like these artists because it's obviously not easy um but yeah i'll give you guys a little look of how they look on my windowsill they're so gorgeous i will make sure to link them down below but it's jam candles i believe so yeah thank you so much okay another box here i think this is my jewelry cover I mean, my duvet. I didn't. I didn't get a cover for it, but this is my duvet I got. This is just for the time being. And then I got this, which I'm so excited for. This is literally just for like a joke use, but it's not though. It's basically like a calluses 
put file remover. It comes with batteries. This shit is no joke. This was like $30. Um, no, I don't actually know how much it was. Maybe it was like 20 But my boyfriend, don't tell anyone I'm telling you this, but he has calluses on his feet and I'm so excited to shave them off with this thing. It's gonna be so fun. So yeah, I got this. This really has turned into a huge haul. Um, I am also filming a like, summer haul video because I did a shop summer shopping with me video. And a lot of the stuff I ordered from that video is here. But I think I'm just going to do film that tomorrow. Some of it isn't here yet, so I think I'm just going to film it as it comes to things. I'm so excited and I want to wear it and stuff. So, yeah. But, like, like, I ordered stuff from Urban and it's right in front of me, but I'm not going to open it until I film that video tomorrow, probably. What is this? Oh, this is from Amazon, but I don't remember ordering this. This is a High Life Portable Garment Steamer. This is going to be really handy because... Obviously, we live in tiny apartments, so I can't have like a huge ass iron, but this little mini steamer is going to be good for getting little kinks out of clothes because not every it's hard to keep everything like without stain or not stains and wrinkles, especially like I fold all my pants, they always have wrinkles in it, so this is going to be great. My boyfriend's going to like this too. Um, and then this box is actually a pair of shoes I think I bought off either Depop or Poshmark. I don't know. Or eBay. I kind of forget which one I bought them off of. This is what they look like. So cute. They're a little kitten heel, tan, buckled, um, like, knee boot, knee high boots? They're like below the knee, but you know what I'm saying. Calf. Um, so cute. These are going to be so good with a skirt, a little dress. I'm just very excited about these. They're so cute. And they were actually pretty reasonably priced. I think I got them for like 60 bucks or something. And they're in pretty good condition. I bought a different pair, I think off of Poshmark. And the little, these parts were completely wrecked. And I can barely wear them when you get them repaired. But these ones are in pretty good condition, so I'm happy about that. So lots of things. Okay. First, we have a case. I did not order this. I simply just did not order this. It says my name on it, though. Kind of confused. I think this company sent me the wrong thing. Because I think I ordered a screen protector. And they gave me this pink case. It's not good for my phone. So that's gonna have to be returned. Okay. These are cute little posters. Um, I thought it was gonna be a lot bigger, I'm not gonna lie. But I think you can order bigger sizes, I'm just stupid. But it's basically like a little tapestry poster of like flowers. It's really cute. So I'm gonna put that on my wall. And then I ordered another one, I think, with mush, but I also ordered these strawberry little napkins, like dish towels. Very cute. They have strawberries all over them. And then I also ordered this Coors X, because I love this stuff. Um, Centella blemish cream. It's just really good for like blemishes and like red spots. And I love the brand Coors X. I think it's Korean, so yeah. Oh, I got this really cute little top. I'll show you guys that later too. And what else? Oh, I got this really obnoxious hat. Just for jokes. Is this like really insane? I think it is. But I got it for jokes, like a little Y2K vibe. If I ever need to go to a Y2K party, I'll be wearing this. But yeah, it's like 
hopefully bedazzled and really obnoxious, but love her. All right, I think we have one last Amazon box. Ooh, this is a bunch of clothes. I ordered some track pants because I really wanted to try their track pants, some sweatpants, some more track pants. So I'm gonna try these all on later and give you guys a full review. Um, you can see what they look on because I don't want to recommend them if they fit horribly or something like that. So yeah, I'm going to try on all the clothes later. But yeah, that was my little unboxing. I have some more packages over here, but I think I can't open them. Just kidding. Okay, so, I, so this is the other print. I'll show you the mushroom print later. And then this is a little top I got. I don't know if this is... um. Lucy's or why this is with my stuff and then one more package oh these are a pair of dickies I ordered some dickies oh fuck did I order navy I meant to order black dickies work pants so yeah that was my haul I'm gonna drink more coffee now I still can't get over these candles definitely my favorite things gorgeous okay so I don't have like a sheet or a duvet cover but I do have a duvet so I'm gonna put the duvet on. So it feels like I have more of a home here. And then I think I have one pillow. Um, uh -huh. yeah, so. One of me and my boyfriend are gonna have to get used to sleeping with one pillow. No, I actually think I have two. Okay, this hopefully will blow up too. I hear it starting to play. This kind of technology is like crazy, guys. Like, what? It just blows up. It's like an alien pretty soft not gonna lie okay so my camera ran out of space but i was trying to show you my duvet oh it's a shitty amazon duvet whatever it's honestly nice because it's like lightweight it was really cheap if you're looking for a cheap queen duvet cover the link is in the description it was very cheap because duvet covers can be expensive but if you're not that picky it's 100% polyester, probably why. If you're not that picky, then it'll do the job. It's like pretty thin, so I think it'll be good for summer. And then I have a pillow with no cover once again. And voila, my bed is made. My new cute boots. Maybe I'll wear these to dinner tonight. My hat from BP Bella. I just don't know if I look good in the trucker hats. This hat is so cute. My boyfriend thinks it look, it's not really me. I feel like, but whatever. I start hanging up some of my clothes because I have all these hangers. And I just want to be a little bit more organized because right now it's a mess. Love this big, nice closet though. Oh, yeah. It's cute, right? You just hung it up. Oh yeah, I did like it. Yeah. You hung it. You don't <laughs> like it anymore? No, I did like it the other day. It looks better on you than it does just on on life. You hung it up the wrong way. Yeah. Thank you. I actually really like this shirt. can really tell my color palette. So where do these go? Um, that one gets hung up. Oh. This one? Um, that one too, because I'm gonna hang up the ones I haven't really taken pictures in, and then the other ones I'll fold and like put in a box or something. You don't have enough hangers for all this. I know, that's why I have to get more hangers from home. Oh, little tripod. This is the progress we've made. Pretty good. Pants. Tops. Some shoes. 
underwear and stuff. But this is everything I want to shoot, which is a lot, but it can be done. And then on this side, it's like random it's things I have already shot or like don't really care about. And then there's more stuff. Honestly, this is a lot of stuff for a month, but you know. <laughs> just going to get some coffee um, and maybe something to eat and then I'm gonna come back here and do some filming but yeah the sleep was so good so much more comfortable than our old bed this bed I mean this mattress is so good like I said I'll have it linked down below I'm actually like I'll talk about it more later but it actually like made you want to it's kind of good and kind of bad because like literally didn't want to get out of bed but it's so comfortable so yeah. Um, hello people. So I just got back from a coffee shop. Got some coffee and sorry I'm out of breath. Also got a smoothie with protein. It's like banana, almond butter. It's like dense on the protein. I mean not crazy or anything, but more filling going to be my breakfast but it's kind of warm right now so i'm going to finish my coffee and put this in the fridge i also got a huge thing of coconut water and a fat snacks it's like these keto cookies that my boyfriend put me on i got those for later i'm going for dinner later with rachel and claire and their mom who's visiting and i'm going to meet up with rachel later but right now i'm going to film the first part of my little summer haul and I also want to film a Q&A and then like keep vlogging obviously for the rest of the day but yeah and my hair looks kind of crazy because we got caught in the rain yesterday after dinner oh let me give you a quick recap on dinner once I um, drink more of my coffee one second this is what I wore also outside this top is just from Brandy and then these pants are from Motel Rocks they're really cute though I actually really like them for the summer they're really like lightweight and they're like baggy i'll try and link them down below if they're still available i know they have like a bunch of different prints and like styles of or not styles um fabrics for this style of pan but yeah okay so now that i'm a little more awake i'll tell you guys about dinner last night it was a little underwhelming just because I have been to this restaurant in Toronto and I love it and we went and it was just like not that good like all the food was pretty mediocre it's pretty expensive the waitress like like she came and she was like oh thank you for coming whatever and like we literally thought we we're still waiting on two we like I ordered two more things and they never came I don't know if that's because I like spoke too quietly. I think it was just like a miscommunication thing, but just overall the experience wasn't amazing. Obviously I give them props for like opening up in New York. Like that's obviously really hard to do, but yeah, that was just like my experience. But I know other people who loved it. I think if you're vegan, you would really enjoy it. But I feel like my body needs meat and yeah, which I'm, I think I'm going for another vegan dinner tonight, which it's unfortunate but it's okay um anywho i'm going to set up a little filming area i think i'm gonna film here honestly and um film this little haul and i have some more i have a skillshare bit to do and i have a better health bit to do one of them might be in this video <laughs> and um i also want to film some tiktoks lots to do let's get to it ladies and gentlemen Okay, so I just finished filming that haul. 
sneak peek super cute new item yeah all this stuff was in the haul it's really cute i really recommend you watch i think i'm actually gonna film two parts because that video was so long i don't know i whoa, i either talk for so long or yeah that's the only reason <laughs> anyways so i meet, meet up with rachel late in a bit soon i told her just to come here and then we could walk to a coffee shop because we don't have wi-fi i need to do some emails so i feel so weird being in here without lucy like i know lucy's gonna watch these videos and it's just gonna like i just feel weird <laughs> hey lucy i'm on your couch I'm curious, did they go painting and like do this at the like paint and was it paint, draw and paint type place? The one where you drink wine and you paint? I feel like three, four of them did this, but I don't recognize any of the names on it. But honestly, I'm gonna pick which one I think is the best. And Lucy, tell me. Honestly, f first glance, I think I like this one the best. I like the tree. Yeah, definitely that one. I don't know. No hate. <laughs> I'm just curious. Who did this? Like, I don't recognize any of the names on the bottom of them. So I, I wonder what this was. Yeah. Okay. try and sit down and film this Q&A but my data has run out again and I have no Wi-Fi so I need to go walk somewhere that has Wi-Fi so I can pay for more data because I can't even see the questions you guys asked me because it won't load so that's awesome possum and then come back I guess and Rachel's gonna come here in like an hour and then we're gonna walk to a cafe and do work Okay, so I just got home from walking to Starbucks to get Wi-Fi to pay for more data, and I did. I paid for like two times, I don't fucking know, $20 worth of data, and it's just still not fucking working. It's really fucking annoying. I can't even like check how much money's in my checkings account because it won't load. This sucks. This really sucks. So I can't film this Q&A. Which sucks. Which really, really fucking sucks. Hopefully I'll film it tomorrow. But yeah. That's what's up. I feel disgusting. I'm gonna go meet Rachel. We're either gonna go to a cafe or go somewhere. I don't know. Update you later. I just got this package from my friend Pierre. Um, Pierre Bazin. Um, I don't even know if that's how you say it. Pierre from Toronto. Love him so much. And he makes his own clothes. And if you guys, I don't know, if you guys have been following me for a while, I posted a picture in one of his sweatshirts a really long time ago. But he came out with these jeans and he finally sent them to me. And I am so excited to wear them. I love them so much. I will have his website down below so good quality so just amazing literally it's a1 it's a1 shit anyway love him has a p on this pocket a b on this one for his name anyway they're so gorgeous i'm so excited to try them on but i gotta go i'm gonna meet rachel at mud started pouring rain walking to come on here to end the vlog um i just did some try-ons for a haul that i'm gonna be uploading soon i pretty much have my room set up hi i got this mirror i can link it down below i got it on amazon it's actually pretty good um it was like a hundred dollars i think and yeah i'll link it in my amazon shop below feet um, this is all stuff I need to do for work. It's still messy. It's not really organized. I got some sheets from Parachute. Um, yeah. 
But my closet's pretty much done. Like, Luca has some stuff over here. Shoes, and um, yeah. But I'll probably start a new vlog very soon. I've just been kind of getting settled. I have a lot of work to catch up on, a lot of admin stuff, so it's not that interesting. But it's been extremely hot the last couple days. I think it's gonna rain the next couple days. I don't know it, what's going on. It's like can't breathe type weather. It's like really disgustingly hot and there's no AC in this room, so it's been hot. <laughs> I feel like I lost my tan. I'm like pale now, but yeah. I'm going to keep working today. I will see you guys in my next video. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and thank you again BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. I love you all.